Hey, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm glad we were properly introduced by your parents. Otherwise, I'm not sure I would have had the courage to talk to you. <laughs> I notice you chatting it up with the others so freely. I can only guess that you knew them beforehand. Or perhaps you just uh, have a bountiful charm. <laughs> You've certainly caught my attention, nonetheless. May I have this dance? <laughs> I suppose we have a lot to cover, consider our arrangement. I've never been fond of the idea of an arranged marriage, but I'm grateful to at least be familiar with you beforehand. You... You... <laughs> How did I not realize? Well, it's probably because of that stupid mask. And the fact that your royal title sounds a lot more tolerable than you ever were. <laughs> I know you're toying with me. Sure, we were only about ten at the time. But that summer, your family spent at our place was miserable. No offense to your parents, just... You, who, by the way, are looking in our direction, just dance with me, okay? <laughs> oh, I will go into detail. While I was trying to grow accustomed to royal duties, watching from afar, how my parents handled the meetings held with yours, you'd sneak in with the pastries you stole from the kitchen. Then you wouldn't stop pestering me and poking at me for being way too serious. And then evidently shoving a pastry into my mouth. Don't remember, I, <laughs> I could go on forever. Uh, yeah, so this will certainly ring a bell, won't it? <laughs> you kept using me as your unwilling sparring partner. Going on and on and on about how you want to be the head of your own royal guard. I told you it was, wasn't practical. And then you jabbed me with your training swords. The bruise took a whole week to heal, you know. Ah, now I know you remember because of the reaction. <laughs> yes, I hated you and your stupid little ambition of being a royal and head of the royal guard. Mm, I see you've been continuing your training since you're light on your feet, aren't you? It doesn't really matter how many classes I've taken. I'm not pretty exquisite at dancing. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? Well, don't pick up the pace. <laughs> Hanging on to you tighter isn't going to make any of this better. Stop already, you're just going to make me trip, and my parents are looking now. Slow down, and just smile. <laughs> Yay, we are having so much fun. Hold me closer. Just do it. So much fun. <laughs> Alright, I think I've had enough dancing. Let's go over to the refreshments, yeah? Hey, what a coincidence. They have your favorite pastries. The ones you would shove into my mouth to shut me up. <laughs> How could I forget? Believe me, I still hold a grudge against you. And great, they're looking me over again. Think of something on the floor, right? I, I, I can feed one to you. What did you expect me to say? Oh, I bullied you because I secretly had a big fat crush on you. Ah, <laughs> uh, there you go. Yeah, it tastes good. 
<laughs> Better than I remember. And now they're laughing. Thank you for this wonderful night of disappointment and humiliation. I've had enough of you. <laughs> I need to get some air. Expect annoying and persistent as I am you. Honestly, at this rate, I'm I'm being forced to marry you. <laughs> I'll just kill you instead. <laughs> Fine, you do have more training. Kill me in your sleep. I, I mean, kill me while I sleep. Just end me. I'm sure you'd find ways anyways. Why wouldn't I be mad at you? I've never been in such a flurry of emotions and dragged around. This isn't what I'm used to. It's just like we remember. I'm the stiff, serious one. You're the rowdy and restless. I know. It was pretty dull before we started talking. I mean, it was obvious how my whole attitude changed before I knew it. And it was you, and then after, and it was like my entire persona crumbled because of you. Don't get me wrong, I'm still a facade. Well, I wouldn't consider it a facade if it's just how I prefer to carry myself. I'll take my mask off, or... Alone, anyways. You don't have to take off yours. I just... Oh. You're right. You look... Different. <laughs> I don't think I changed that much. Oh, well... <laughs> oh, thank you. You look lovely as well. I'm not just saying that to be nice, I'm being honest. This feels so nostalgic, I've been alone out here at night countless of times, and it's not the same as when we were younger, and stayed up way past our bedtimes. I kept telling you I saw shadows in the bushes, and you would just stand in front of me declaring that you'd protect me. And then the leaves would rustle, and I would grab your hand, and run, except I was too busy freaking out, so I tripped and slid into the mud. We both got into a lot of trouble, but that's silly. But it's just the little moments that are true memories that I'll cherish forever. <laughs> the world seems so much more vibrant when we were younger. And it has become more dull that to me preparing now. Perhaps it's the reality of growing up. Preparing to inherit a kingdom and overlaying the stress of meeting expectations. It only makes sense that you feel stress as well. Go on. I see. Well, I don't think your bright aura is... A complete act? Sure, you were a bit shy in the past, but you were always a determined type. I'm glad to see you hold yourself with more confidence, even if you're secretly anxious all the time. You bring that in bright aura, honestly. Brought more light into places that I've known. It's most likely the memories we had together, but... I'm grateful for it still. Really? I don't think I'm in need of protection, but by all means, save me, heir to the kingdom and head of the royal guard. <laughs> Alright, I'm coming, coming. What are we going to do? 
finally investigate those bushes. <laughs> but not to sound like a stick in the mud, but we really shouldn't be running. Neither of us is dressed appropriately, so don't tell me you're taking us to... Yes, just let me catch my breath. Oh, I didn't think you remembered. <laughs> I remember since it's been so long. The hill looks so much smaller now. But the ballroom still looks so far away from here. Even if we're not that far, just the contrast makes the night sky and light make it seem like a bubble. <laughs> like the stress is in its own world now. <laughs> And as of right now, I'm stuck with you. <laughs> I'll gladly shove you off, but this isn't really a good idea to ruin your attire. Do I even need to ask? <laughs> it isn't. Roll down the hill on your own time. Hey, you... <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> Jeez, it's gonna hurt in the morning. Let me see. Hold on. <laughs> you lie. Don't scare me like that. <laughs> it's not a big deal. I didn't really like this outfit that much anyways. It's very constricting. We can just lay here for a while. Look, I know we don't have to do this. I know our marriage is supposed to be arranged, but our parents aren't ruthless. Well, mine aren't, at least. As long as I formulate my words to the utmost perfection, I can basically explain how this decision isn't a good idea. I can normally, I can continue acting as their perfect, well-spoken hair, and tell them that there is not a way to unite kingdoms. There really doesn't need to be any of this at all. I mean, neither of us wanted this in the first place, really. I I'm not saying that I wouldn't want to marry you. I mean, I just... No, 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 no. I do. I mean, I, I would like to be with you, if you like that too, of course. Well, what do you want me to ask? Did you want me to bring out all of my charm or something? As if you could do better. Uh, hey, why are you getting down on one knee? I mean, yes, I'd love to court you. Here, I'll get on one knee as well. Oh, we've only spent time together in the past, and I... And tonight, but I feel like you know me better than anyone. Than that I can truly be myself with you. Even if the world seems daunting, I think we could do anything together. May I have the honor of having your hand and being by your side as both my best friend and wife. <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs> I guess I did bully you because, well, I loved you. And just a little, though. <laughs> Hey, you win this training on me too? If you want to kiss me, you don't have to pin me down like that. <laughs> I missed you too. Mm. 
<laughs> Look at us. Just some idiots in the grass. Doesn't matter whether or not you kill me in my sleep or not. I know you will be the devil. 